In this video, we will run through how to get all of your app's users to link their social media so that they can post to their own accounts. This video is targeted to folks building on the no-code software development platform, Bubble.io. First, a quick look at the requirements. You will need a Bubble account and an Airshare Business Plan account, which allows you to link all your app's users. In this video, we are focusing specifically on the account linking flow. To build a complete social media posting app, you will also need to build a user login system and the social media posting workflow. Instead of a login flow, we created a simple database of users with their profile keys. You can create your users in Airshare with an API call, which returns the profile key for that user. You will store those keys in your database. In this demo app, the drop-down user selector simulates the login flow. We can see that when we switch users, their respective profile keys are displayed. Now we will set up two API calls. The first call we set up will return a secure URL that lets your users link their social accounts. The second call will be used to return the list of social accounts that the user has linked so we can display it in the app. Let's get started. The first step is to install the Bubble API Connector plugin. Create an API call and give it a name. We called it Airshare API. Then create the first API call to the Generate JWT endpoint. This call will send data about your user to Airshare and will return a secure URL which you will launch to show the account linking page. More details on how to set up this call are in the link below in the video description. We did include the logout and redirect parameters in our call. These are optional parameters and are explained in more detail in the docs. Let's create the second API call to the user endpoint. This call will return all the linked social networks for that particular user. This is a get call and only requires the authorization header with the user's profile key. Once these two calls are set up, let's go to our design. You can create a button to let your user link their accounts. Add a bubble workflow. Only one step is needed, which is the open and external website. For the destination, insert dynamic data and select the Generate JWT API call that you created. Use the URL as the output. Remember to include the user's profile key from your database as the profile key in the API call. To display the linked accounts for the user, Let's add dynamic text to this text field element. Select the Active Social Account API call you created and remember to add the profile key after the word bearer with a space separating them. Let's click Preview and test the app. Switching users and clicking the button shows that we are linking accounts for different users. We can see the text on the account linking page is different for each profile. Let's log in as Bob and link some of Bob's accounts. We linked Twitter and YouTube. Clicking the Done button redirects us back to the app. Now we can see that Bob's linked accounts are shown. The next step is to build the posting API call to send posts to that user's linked social accounts. You can learn more about the posting API calls and all the other great features of Airshare in the docs. Thank you for watching this video, and we wish you the best of luck on your bubble and Airshare journey.